are at uh, what, we're, what we call Ag Night with the Nashville Sounds, and you got a chance to tour the facilities, and you heard from the career of the panelists. What's it been like for you to be here? But it's been a real pleasure to hear this great panel and uh, just gain so much knowledge that I can use for my future. All my family does. My family's been dairy farmers, but when I was born, they sold that and um, have just been retired from that. But being around that, I've been around farmers and all that my whole life. I would definitely say, I'm not sure specifically which niche, as um, Mr. Jason said, he falls into, um, so that might take some time, but definitely I would love to be in an agriculture career. Things like this are awesome to get our youth involved. You know, I'm definitely a firm believer coming up through FFA that, that the youth kind of are the future, and, and I think as we know, agriculture continues to be the number one industry and very, very important. You're going to get to watch a baseball game here shortly. It's a beautiful night. What do you think about the day? Uh, it's been nice out. Uh, I got to learn some stuff about agriculture and tour the stadium and learn some more about it in agriculture. I think it's great that all the kids are wanting to get involved because uh, agriculture right now is a less than 2% of the population and if it's going to continue we got to have more involved in it. There's so many career opportunities to be involved in agriculture without re being directly involved in production. There's, there's sales and service and, and parts and, and working on as well as producing and marketing and communicating. It's on us as producers and everybody in the ag community to build that interest, to make it interesting for everybody to be involved in, be it social media or being out in the communities like we are tonight.